We're on the cusp of a colossal occasion, a semi-final encounter here at the Euros, and the nerves must surely be jangling. Who will come out on top? Stay tuned for all the action on EA TV. Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray and I'm joined here on the gantry for commentary by Stuart Robson. And we're at a very important stage of this cup competition, the semi-final stage. Stuart, your expectations? Well, semi-finals can be very nervous affairs, Derek, but this has the making of an absolute classic. Two excellent teams, some great players and two thoughtful coaches. This should be a very interesting tactical battle, I think. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Bruno Fernandes plays alongside Vitor Ferreira in central midfield, and the starting role in attack is handed to Cristiano Ronaldo. Well, foul play, says the referee. <laughs> oh, tremendous vision. Well, here it is again. He's alive to the situation. He makes good contact with the ball and he keeps it down. That's a nice-headed goal. And Portugal get the game restarted. Disappointed to have conceded. Now can they come up with a quick response? Well, a swift challenge and a throw-in coming up. Deserves credit for winning the ball back. Minch. And Palinha with it. Silva. Decent looking pass. Ronaldo Silva. And quick thinking defensively. Not to like about that pass. Well, a fierce effort, but quite simply not accurate enough. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Rafael Leao. And good work from Portugal to win it back. Joao Cancelo. Bruno Fernandes has it. Ronaldo. On to Fernandes. Bernardo Silva, and a chance to level it. Four marks to the keeper. Well, what a reaction from the goalkeeper. Such a good save in the end. Biol. Good weight on that pass. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Nice ball over the top. Silva. And a simple clearance, a good one.
Ferreira. Oh, good looking run. It has to be a goal. Real excitement. A back and forth type of game. Now they're level. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And the finish is clinical. He just makes it look so easy, doesn't he? So in business once more on the back of that very important equaliser. 1-1. Jan Malaka. Well, Portugal with the ball again. Mensch. Ronaldo. Real chance. And a goal! How important could that be in the story of this semi final? Wild celebrations. Well, this is worth seeing again. Just look how Ronaldo goes beyond his man. And this is Ronaldo at his best. He's composed, he shows great technique, and he just smashes it beyond the keeper. So there we have it, 2-1. And with that, the attack fizzles out. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. And with that, they've thwarted the opportunity. That is that for the first half here. Well, underway once more. And it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half. Joao Cancelo. Well, they're a bit like a passing machine. And you can understand why they want to play it that way in front as they are. Now they've lost it. Well, it's a decent-looking attack, this. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Now breaking at pace. Potential danger. That's a lovely ball. Palinha. It's with Joao Cancelo. Ronaldo lost it. Cesco. Now, who can he play it to? Opportunity here. And just the tackle that was needed. Oh, what an opportunity. Big chance it is. Well, plenty of power there, but in fairness, should have made the keeper work. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Useful looking position, you've got to say. And based on that challenge, you wouldn't be at all surprised if the referee reaches for his pocket. Well, he's gone into the book. Well, he was late and he deserved a booking for that.
he's gone for goal. Well, the free kick taken, but saved easily by the keeper. And into the last 20 minutes. He continues his run. This could be the equaliser. What an important piece of defending. Now in a more than decent position. Joao Cancelo. Pepe. Joao Cancelo. Back with Silva. Well, the keeper certainly didn't want to gamble with that. And a corner it'll be. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Short corner favourite. Leal. Now with Silva. Oh, might be. Vital intervention. If they can score again from this corner, it probably would be the end of the story. They take it short. Fernando Silva. My goodness, that save. Fully stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel. Let's see about the delivery. No one able to do any damage with it. And Portugal with the ball again. Oh, in with a chance! And huge credit to the goalkeeper. They're not out of this. And could that save just inspire them? They need to get the ball forward quickly here. And a short corner, let's see. Joao Felix. That's a very fine piece of tackling. And it's in! A two-goal cushion! And just look at these fans! They now believe that a trip to the final is theirs! Let's take another look, and it's a very good goal. And they deserve it, you have to say. They've been excellent. <laughs> Underway again with the score at 3-1. The referee's verdict is three additional minutes. And play halted, free kick given. cross that will live long in the... and now it's all over and Portugal have made it through to the final here at the Euros well they won most of the individual battles all over the park today and that was key to their comfortable win in the end it was a really composed display in a very important game and they'll certainly fancy their chances in the final and on the back of this no doubt about it Cristiano Ronaldo generating headlines well, what more could you ask for? His build-up play was clever, his movement was dynamic, and he scored a couple of goals. What a play.